This is one of the oldest <laughs> interface, kind of suck, it's so small. I'll give you another quick trick with this. If you had a mod delay, simple, and you just make it like, what? Let's say 19 milliseconds. Help me dry your matches in. All right, end of the year, my most used free plugins in 2021. Let's take a look. Hello everyone, welcome back to Mix Best TV. Hope you're having a great day. Before we start, please check the info box down below for my mixing courses on ProMix Academy, free plugins, special discounts and offers, and of course, link to all the free plugins that are gonna see in this video. And if you wanna support the channel, but most important, if you really wanna learn how to mix and master professionally, click the join button down here, become a Mix Best TV member, access the already big and always growing library of full mixing courses, start to finish on many different genres, mastering courses, special videos, and you also get mixed consultations with me via Skype or email. And if you missed, the biggest event of the year happening right now on the channel. The remix contest for my artist Bella Kelly latest single Heartbreak Motel is up and running right now with over $30,000 in prices in plugins and hardware. And you get a free Sibilance plugin from Waves just to enter the contest. Links down below, let's get to the video. All right, this wants to be another rapid fire list, so I'm not gonna stop on each plugin too long. We're just gonna hear them quickly. My most used free plugins in 2021. We start with Bark of Dog. This is a little gem of a plugin and I still have a hard time believing it's free. This is version two of a resonant low pass filter and has three modes, classic, passive and combo. My favorite, usually combo. It's basically the free and alternative version to UAD Voice of God. It sounds great and the three modes are very different one another so you'll have fun using this. Let's give it a quick spin on drums. Classic is definitely nice. Let's go quickly to the next one. G Set Plus, this is a little dirty beast. It's a saturator slash clipper. You have independent controls for odd and even harmonics, a clip ceiling and over sample. It also has four characters, clean, warm, crisp and classic stages and saturation control. And this is free. Here it sounds really quick. Note the nominal level, again, with clippers and saturators. We are used to take a look at that on the channel, even in classic mode, same or lower nominal level, louder. Let's get to number three. Another saturator, this is called Burrier from Kit Plugins. That's actually the first time that I heard the company uh, because of this plugin. It's another saturator, pretty simple, but it's pretty nasty. Low cut and high cut filter if you need them. A mix knob on board, let's give it a spin.
To me, it sounds really cool. I use it on drums, either single, like snares or kicks, but it's also great on vocals and bass in case you wanna try it. And electric guitars. Number four, this is one of the oldest <laughs> interface, kinda suck, it's so small, but I still use it, it sounds good, is the BX sub filter. Sub filter, you have few controls in and out, type punch, low end, and the resonance control, low, high, or extreme for the low bump, okay? Anytime you need a little more umph and low energy and deep low end, okay? Let's give it a try. What I like about this, you just saw it, it's really quick to use. You just nail the frequency and then compensate for the low end boost and move the resonances around, job done. Let's get to the next one. A1 Stereo Control Alex Hilton. They also make an automatic trigger that is free and is cool. This stereo manipulator has pretty much all the controls that the paid stereo manipulator and widener have and more. For example, you have mute mid and mute side. If you wanna monitor one of the two, you have a swap left and right, flip phase, mono, safe bass control, and you select the frequency. And then it also has an expert mode for the pan and the stereo with that actually makes it better than some of the paid option. For example, for example, fix mid level. This is something that I think it's very important when you start opening up and uh, widening material. Bind MS level so you keep the relationship intact dual pan or balance, you have linear logarithmic options, you have pan law, minus three or minus six. We talked about pan law in an old video. If you don't know what that is, check that out. Let's give it a little spin. You hear the difference between the binding MS levels and uh, mid fix level, right? All right, not much more to add. Like I said, I want this to be a quick list, but this is pretty impressive. It has a bunch of options that many of the paid options don't have, and it's free. Let's get to the next one. This video is brought to you by Tonor TC40 USB microphone, one of the best affordable all-in-one USB microphones out there. Plug and play integrated preamp with level control and mute function, headphones jack with zero latency monitoring, and it comes with a shock mount, a pop filter, and a mounting arm for your desk. Ideal for music recordings, live streaming, podcast interviews, and gaming. Get it for $69 only in the link in the description down below. I'll show you guys this one before is Crush from Trictic. It is still one of my favorite destructors and saturator out there, especially for the modulation options that it has. This little guy has three main knobs, the drive, the crush, and the DWSP, plus filters and the modulation. The drive sounds really, really cool. And this is pretty much my first choice when I need a beat crusher as well, because that's what the crush and the DWSP are. As you can see, you have two sliders for dry and wet, so you can balance the distorted signal with the dry. There's also a link, so you can move them at the same time. And then you have the bit crusher part. Let's turn the dry down so you can hear it.
for that lo-fi sound and the cool thing is that you can modulate with this so we can give the drive a little bit of modulation let's give it all of them just so you can see and create effects like that. Again, free crush from Trick Tick. Next one. Voxango has many free plugins, so you should definitely check them all out. But the one that I personally use the most is Bugex, which is an amp simulator, Mset, which is a stereo mid-side manipulator, Span, the famous frequency analyzer, and Tube Amp, which is the one that I have open right here. This is a really cool emulation of a tube preamp. So it can be very subtle, and I like subtle when we talk about saturation. And you can also do full tube distortion, drive, bias, low pass frequency, dry. It's nice, isn't it? Even when you level match, you hear that this one has a really nice low-end color. Uh, usually tube saturator and tube emulation tend to be more sparkly and add mid-range to top enhancement. This is very muscular and beefy at the bottom and I like it. And it's kind of crazy that it's free because I think it's one of the best tube emulation out there. It's got two modes. Mode two is the more pronounced and mode one is subtle. All right, again, anytime you want a little saturation, a little more richness, tube vibe, call it the way you want. Voxango Tube Amp is a no-brainer because it's free and it sounds great. Next one is TSC BOD Bass Overdrive. It's an emulation of a very famous bass pedal, which I really loved. I'm talking about the actual pedal. We were using it when we were in the band and then later on I've been using it for mixing uh, for a lot of things. This is a bass pedal, but it's great, again, on snare and vocals, like in parallel distortion. It's a really cool plugin, it sounds great, it's free. Let's give it a spin. Just like the pedal, you can use it for subtle growl or like full-blown distortion. I think it sounds really, really good. And like I said, I happen to use it on vocal several times. Help me dry on my tears and help me I lay on my fears and help me I think I am falling. To see anybody hear me calling. Help me dry on my tears and help me I lay on my fears and help me I think I am falling. To see anybody hear me calling. I'm alright. I'll give you another quick trick with this. If you had a mod delay, simple, and you just make it like what? Let's say 19 milliseconds. Help me dry on my tears and help me I lay on my fears and help me I think I am falling. To see anybody hear me calling. Help me dry on my tears and help me I lay on my fears and help me I think I am. And you have a dirty stereo effects. Next one, isotope vinyl. Again, an old one, but still cool for all the lo-fi effect and the vinyl effects. Let's try it really quick on this piano. Thank you. 
It's also cool on returns of delays and reverb if you want to lo-fi your effects. And I think this is it. These were my most used free plugins in 2021. If you liked this video, please don't forget to leave a like and comment down below what were your most used free plugins this year. All the links are going to be in the info box down below. So is the link to the remix context. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Stay safe. See you next time.